so now we'll see how to modify the table maintenance generator once we created if there is any further changes in table maintenance generator so how can you modify that we'll observe that So first go to the table in change mode and navigate to where we can find table maintenance generator. This one right, mm. utilities. So this is the table maintenance generator. For this, table maintenance generator is already available. Right? Yes, yes. Let's assume someone ask you to add one more field to this existing table okay for example some phone number or uh, city what is the data standard data element for city what is zero one so we have enhanced a table so since it is a custom table you can directly add uh, additional fields you just change the table and add the additional fields. For example, if it is a standard table, what we need to do? Can we directly add fields to the standard table if you need any custom fields? No, no. Sir. we have to use no, the append structure. We have to use append structure and in, in some tables you can find uh, CA include structures, include structures also. There you can add your custom fields. Okay. Since it is a custom table, I'm directly adding fields to this. Okay. Can we can we uh, change the primary key field? There is one primary key here, right? Can I remove that key as primary key? Yeah, you can do that, but you have to adjust the data. You are going to lose some data because till now the data is identified by this primary key, right? Uniquely, if you remove this key as primary key, you may lost some data records in the table or you can add a new primary key if you want right you have to whenever you are going to change the primary keys you should be very careful because you are going to lose some data okay clear now i've added the new field and activate it Now, for the record, for each record, can you find a value for city? So, since we newly added this, since we newly added this field to the table, you cannot find any data for this uh, city field, right? Going forward, whenever you create data in the table, then the city data will be populated. But at present, you cannot find any values for this uh, city whenever you are working with uh, data dictionary tables right what type of table it is what type of table that we are working here this is transparent table so the same table structure will be available in backend database right the same structure name table name with the same fields will be available in backend database okay so where exactly it is activating it is going to apply all these table changes in backend database right we are using Data dictionary as an interface between backend database and uh, AWAP application layer. So this is the newly added field. There is no data for that. Right? City. Now, now go to the table maintenance. We have already created table maintenance generator, right? For this uh, table. Go to SM30. Display. Can you find uh, the newly added field here? It's some cities. No. It is country. It is not city. It is oh, city. Sorry. City. Why? Country. City. It is not city. Sorry. Can you find the newly added field here in the table maintenance screen? No. Sir. No. Whenever you did some changes to the table, you have to modify the.
corresponding table maintenance generator also okay for that go to table maintenance generator because when you generated the maintenance screen right it will generate some a program and some screens by default okay but whenever we do table changes those changes will not automatically reflect in those uh, automatically generated program and screens we have to modify again how to change it here you can see this symbol change now what is the change we did new field in the structure right we added a new field right so what is this option for field removed from the structure for example if you if we deleted any if we delete any field from the table existing table at that time we need to select this right so wh what is the change we did now new field added click select that option and continue so we, we are using only overview screen right for this maintenance screen so select overview screen or if, if you want to you can select both also nothing will happen select both it, what is the type what is the field we have added is it a primary key field or non non primary key field non primary no, normal field if you want to select you can select both okay it will just regenerate no, nothing uh, nothing wrong in it okay mute continue the steps are same even if you delete any fields from the table for example if you don't need any specific field anymore in the table and you deleted it and uh, what you need to do you need to regenerate the table maintenance screen here what is the option you have to select table field removed from the structure click on continue it's going to regenerate the maintenance program now i'm now now i have navigated to the direct t code in the last session we created a t code right for this uh, stable maintenance screen zcast i have directly used that t code to open the screen otherwise you can go to sm30 and display okay whenever you do any change if you change the field name if you change the data element whatever you do this maintenance you have to regenerate the maintenance screen clear so now our new field is available here you can maintain data as per your requirement okay save it is it clear yes, that's how that's how we generate the maintenance screen also if there are any more complex changes you can directly delete this uh, maintenance screen delete the complete maintenance screen and uh, create again like this i completely deleted the maintenance screen and regenerating again but when you do, when you do this right you are going to lose uh, overview screen changes what we did and uh, sometimes we used to write uh, some code event code you are going to lose that changes also now recreate again create so this field number is already utilized right in the previous uh, so that we have to find screen numbers propose screen numbers
so create it save our maintenance screen got generated now test it so it is regenerated again clear but even if you delete the table maintenance generator you are not going to lose any data because we are not deleting the data but we are deleting only the maintenance screen okay now for example if you want to change the uh, field headings or something layout screen layout go to maintenance screen click on the maintenance screen since we have only single screen we have overview screen go to layout go to layout 